Black inventors have encountered several hurdles throughout history, including enslavement, prejudice, and racism. Despite these difficulties, they have astounded the world with their ingenuity and inventiveness, leaving an indelible mark on our lives. We hope to showcase the tremendous brilliance, resilience, and aesthetic talent displayed by black inventors throughout history in this video. This video will highlight the full breadth of black brilliance that has touched our world, from innovative technology advancements to life-saving medical discoveries, from inspirational creative inventions to significant social contributions. Before we begin, we would appreciate it if you support by hitting the like button and subscribing to the channel. This way, you may watch the entire series and remain up to date on our fascinating discoveries. 15. Nathaniel Alexander, The Folding Chair Nathaniel Alexander, an African-American from Lynchburg, Virginia, received a patent for a folding chair on July 7, 1911. His chair was designed to be used in schools, churches, and auditoriums. Notable among Alexander's novel features was the incorporation of a book rest that could be utilized by the person sitting behind, making it ideal for church or choral settings. While it wasn't the first folding chair patent in the US, his clever addition of the book rest made it suitable for circumstances where the back of one chair could act as a desk or shelf for the person sat behind. This would be very beneficial for arranging rows of chairs for choirs so that each performer could rest their music on the chair in front of them. Similarly, during services, churches could set prayer books, hymnals, or Bibles on the reading shelf. 14. Andrew Jackson, The Automatic Railroad Car Coupler African-American inventor Andrew Jackson Beard was born into slavery in Jefferson County, Alabama. After achieving liberation at the age of 15, he worked as a farmer before embarking on the construction and operation of a flour mill in Woodlawn in 1890. During this time, Beard made important improvements to the Jenny Coupler, a system used to safely and efficiently connect railroad trains, eliminating the hazardous manual task of inserting a pin between the cars. It should be noted that Beard himself had lost a leg in an automobile coupling accident. The connection operation could now be carried out automatically thanks to his inventive design. Beard earned two patents in acknowledgement of the worth of his innovation, the first of which he sold for a substantial sum of $50,000 in 1897, equivalent to nearly $1.8 million by today's standards. His improved coupler became the first extensively used automatic coupler in the United States, coinciding with the passing of the Federal Safety Appliance Act by the United States Congress in 1887, which regulated the use of automatic couplers, rendering any railroad car without them unlawful to operate. Andrew Jackson Beard's pioneering discovery set the framework for the present railway system's automatic couplers. 13. Alfred Benjamin, Stainless Steel Scouring Pad The scouring pad is essential in culinary processes since it is an extremely convenient way to remove burnt-on residues from cast iron cookware, broilers, and stove burners. Its adaptability allows it to tackle a variety of cleaning tasks, including hard water stains in the bathroom, cooked-on grease on grills, and soap scum in the shower. Alfred Benjamin, an African-American inventor who patented the stainless steel scouring pad on June 19, 1962, is responsible for this essential breakthrough. This first invention paved the way for further advancements, including the now common plastic needle surface scouring pad. 12. Granville Taylor Woods Multiplex Railway Telegraph Dubbed the Black Edison, Granville Taylor Woods was a well-known African-American inventor with an amazing portfolio of over 50 patents. The synchronous multiplex railway telegraph, his extraordinary invention, transformed communications between moving trains and train terminals. The system worked by creating a magnetic field around a coiled wire beneath the train, allowing for efficient communication while the train was moving. Woods obtained a patent for his invention in 1887 after submitting extensive notes, illustrations, and a functional model. The invention's success encouraged Woods to form the Woods Electric Company in Cincinnati, Ohio, to promote and sell his patents. Notably, Thomas Edison later claimed ownership of the invention, claiming that he had previously invented a comparable telegraph. 
Woods, on the other hand, successfully defended his rights twice, arguing that he had no other devices to develop his revolutionary idea. 11. Gerhard Sessler and James Edward Mossier West, the foil electric microphone. While working on devices for human hearing research, Gerhard Sessler and James Edward West devised the foil electric microphone in 1962. This revolutionary microphone has more capacitance than typical condenser microphones and does not require a DC bias. Sessler and West painstakingly adjusted the mechanical and surface properties of the system, resulting in a considerably enhanced microphone device. Currently, nearly 90% of microphones produced annually rely on foil electric principles, with applications in a wide range of common products such as cell phones, camcorders, hearing aids, baby monitors, and audio recording devices, among others. 10. William Chester Ruth Self-Lifting Farm Elevator William Chester Ruth, an African-American inventor, made substantial innovations to the farm elevator around 1930. He invented a steel chute with a chain and slat action that allowed grain, feed bags, hay bales, ear corn, and other agricultural products to be transported up onto a vehicle, corn crib, or hay mow. Ruth's electric-powered elevator has discrete but tightly coupled gears for activating the chain conveyor and elevating the elevator. The motor's power was efficiently transmitted between the conveyor and the elevator's height adjustment with a simple pull of a lever. His self-lifting agricultural elevator was widely adopted, particularly in Chester County's commercial mushroom business. 9. Elijah McCoy Automatic Lubricator for Steam Engines Elijah McCoy devised an automatic lubricator for oiling locomotive and ship steam engines while working in a home-based manufacturing business in Ypsilanti, Michigan. In 1872, he patented this revolutionary invention as an improvement in lubricators for steam engines. These automatic lubricators revolutionized railroads by allowing trains to travel quicker and more profitably, with fewer stops for lubrication and maintenance. The McCoy lubricator was used on practically all North American railroads by 1899, according to the Michigan Bureau of Labor and Industrial Statistics, demonstrating its significant impact on the transportation industry. 8. Bessie Blunt, Amputee Self-Feeding Device Bessie Blunt, 37, invented an ingenious electric self-feeding apparatus for amputees while working at the Bronx Hospital in New York. Blunt built a prototype of her invention out of plastic she molded with boiling water and everyday tools like a file, ice pick, hammer, and crockery. The device was equipped with a tube that was supposed to feed individual portions of food to the patient's mouth. The next portion of food would be supplied to the mouthpiece from the associated machine by biting down on the tube. This groundbreaking device enabled patients to control their food intake without the need for outside support. She is well known today for inventing the first electric device for feeding amputees. 7. Otis Boykin, Control Unit for the Artificial Cardiac Pacemaker The artificial cardiac pacemaker is a medical device that regulates the electrical activity of the heart and keeps it in a normal rhythm. It is made up of two main parts, the pulse generator and the control unit. The control unit, also known as the programmer or external programmer, is a device used by healthcare practitioners to interface with and program the artificial cardiac pacemaker settings. Medical practitioners can use this gadget to change various parameters of the pacemaker to meet the needs of the specific patient. African-American inventor Otis Boykin is credited with developing the control unit for the artificial cardiac pacemaker. 6. George Edward Alcorn, X-ray Spectrometer George Edward Alcorn, an African-American inventor, is most known for inventing the X-ray Spectrometer, for which he received the coveted NASA Goddard Space Flight Center Award for Inventor of the Year in 1984. As a scientific tool, the X-ray Spectrometer is extremely important, with numerous applications in a variety of sectors. This technology is used by scientists to examine and determine the composition of unknown materials, discover impurities or contaminants, and evaluate the quality and purity of substances. Furthermore, 
X-ray spectrometers are important in archaeology and art restoration. These instruments are used to evaluate ancient artifacts, paintings, and cultural heritage objects in a non-destructive manner. Researchers get vital information regarding the origin, age, and authenticity of these artifacts by determining their elemental makeup. George Edward Alcorn's extraordinary X-ray spectrometer innovation was so influential that he was appropriately admitted into the National Inventors Hall of Fame in 2015, further recognizing his significant contributions to the profession. 5. Valerie Thomas Illusion Transmitter Valerie Thomas, an African-American inventor, is famous for inventing one of the most astonishing inventions of the 20th century, which is still relevant today. Her groundbreaking invention, known as the Illusion Transmitter, is credited with transmitting three-dimensional images across a long distance, giving the appearance that they are there in front of a mirror. Simply described, Imagine your television displaying the on-screen image as a three-dimensional depiction directly into your living room. The illusion transmitter creates an optical illusion of a genuine three-dimensional image at the receiving end by using concave mirrors on both ends of the transmission. Valerie Thomas's brilliant invention has cemented her reputation as one of the 20th century's most notable black inventors. NASA continues to use her technique and is currently investigating its potential applications in surgical equipment, as well as television and video. 4. Garrett Morgan The Three Light Traffic Signal and Gas Masks Garrett Morgan is widely known for inventing the contemporary Three Light Traffic Signal, which was motivated by watching an accident and resulted in the adoption of the famous green, yellow, and red traffic lights we use today. This, however, was not his only accomplishment. He filed a patent for the first gas mask in 1912, but its significance was not fully understood until two years later. Morgan and a crew of men used gas masks to successfully rescue a group of workmen who became trapped in a tunnel beneath Lake Erie after an explosion. The gas mask was designed with a moist sponge to filter smoke and cool the air. It took advantage of smoke and gases' tendency to climb to higher positions, leaving a more breathable layer of air below. The air intake tube dangled at the floor of the safety cow, pulling clean air from the lowest level, where smoke was less concentrated. This brilliant technology allowed for emergency respiration and was extremely effective in saving lives. Garrett Morgan won a patent for his gas mask creation in 1914, as well as a gold award from the International Association of Fire Chiefs. His safety hood was extensively utilized at the time and contributed greatly to the survival of many people. 3. Henry Blair Mechanical planter both the seed planter and cotton. Planter Both the seed planter and the cotton planter, which served as inspiration for modern mechanical farm tools, were invented by a black innovator during a period of extreme racial bigotry and persecution. Henry Blair, the second African-American inventor to be given a U.S. patent, was honored for two outstanding discoveries. His first invention, the seed planter, was patented on October 14, 1834, and it revolutionized farming by allowing farmers to plant more corn with less labor and in less time. On August 31, 1836, he received a second patent for the cotton planter, a device that used two shovel-like blades pushed by a horse to split the ground, followed by a wheel-driven cylinder that dropped seeds into the freshly plowed soil. Despite being illiterate and having no formal education, Blair had been a successful farmer for years before adopting these improvements to improve farming efficiency. His intellectual genius was further underscored by the fact that his inventions are still relevant and useful in today's farming operations. 2. Charles Brooks, Street Sweepers the modern street sweepers have changed the chore of keeping roadways clean, making sanitation and rubbish collection faster and more efficient. Charles Brooks, an African-American inventor, is responsible for this astonishing creation. His concept for the street sweeper attempted to improve on the current, less effective sweepers in use at the time. Brooks sweeper, unlike others, was a self-propelled truck with whirling brushes mounted to the front fender. His design genius also provided for interchangeable brushes, allowing for the addition of scrapers for snow removal when needed. 
Brooks secured a patent for his invention on March 17, 1896, and shortly after, on May 12, 1896, he patented a dustproof collection bag to supplement the street sweeper. Although nothing is known about his life, we do know that George M. Halstead and Plummer S. Page funded the creation of his sweeper. Each sweeper cost around $2,000 and was made in Scranton, Pennsylvania. The success of the sweeper resulted in a $100,000 contract from the Pennsylvania state government. Brooks' ingenious design drew praise, and the Buffalo, New York, maintenance supervisor adopted his plan for the city's roadways. 1. Alice Parker, the gas furnace. Because central gas heating had not yet been established in the early 1900s, individuals had to rely on burning coal or wood as their major heating source. Despite the fact that the notion of furnaces and central heating dates back to the Roman Empire, science had made only minor advances over the years, and by the end of the 19th century, the heating systems in use were still very simple. During a severe winter in New Jersey, African-American inventor Alice Parker discovered that the fireplace alone was not enough to keep her home warm. This motivated her to create the first natural gas furnace and the first heating system with individually regulated air ducts to ensure even heat distribution throughout the structure. 2. Ultimately, we hope that this video has enlightened you on the amazing contributions made by black inventors throughout history. From basic products like traffic lights and gas furnaces to momentous innovations like the X-ray spectrometer and the illusion transmitter, black inventors have left an unmistakable impact on our world. Their inventiveness and innovation have broken down boundaries and biases, transforming industries and enriching our lives in numerous ways. We commemorate the bravery and creativity of black inventors who surmounted difficulties to leave a lasting legacy of innovation and advancement by spotlighting these 15 creations. If you enjoyed this video please leave a like and a sub and we'll catch you guys in the next one.